Hi, this is Jeff of SimSamurai.net. Uh, this is a quick tutorial video on how to set up a floor style cutting platform. Um, I commonly use this for cutting 4x8 sheets of plywood or 48 by 96 full uh, 3 quarter inch sheets of plywood for cockpit building. Um, basically what you see here are 4x4 four four posts. I had gotten two at 8 foot lengths. I cut them down to 4 foot sections. So two posts cut into two lengths of 4 feet uh, equals four sections as you see here and then you will lay your sheets of plywood down on top of this for cutting your plywood. You can do this with 2x4s. Um, I don't recommend doing it with one 2x4 or you know four sections at four foot of 2x4. You can double up two pieces of 2x4 and if you do that you want to screw them together but then also recess the screws into the piece of plywood uh, at least a half inch and, and I'll talk about that in a moment um, and why you should do that. Um, but basically as you can see here, um, this provides a really stable platform for cutting plywood. Of course, when you pick these up um, at your Home Depot or whatever hardware store or lumber yard, you want to look for the straightest, cleanest ones you can find. Um, you know, get ones that are relatively not free, uh, meaning you know, no knots. I mean, of course, that's going to be difficult to do. You're going to have some knots, but just find the cleanest and straightest ones you can get. Um, but what the four foot, or excuse me, four inch post will do for you. Um, is that it provides enough clearance for you to get your clamp underneath for using a cutting guide or a rip fence. Um, and you're basically going to use this to clamp down what is commonly called a rip fence or cutting guide. And this is what you're going to use, um, as you will see in other tutorial videos, you place your saw up against this to make a very clean, accurate cut. Um, in fact, a lot of carpenters do actually use this style of floor cutting platform for cutting sheets of plywood, or especially big sheets of plywood, simply because using a table saw uh, to cut a 4 by 8 sheet ply, uh, four by eight sheet of plywood is actually kind of difficult if you don't have a very big carpentry or wood shop to cut it on a table saw. Um, you can of course rip it the long way down the 8 foot length on a table saw, but you commonly need at least two people, uh, one person on each end, one person to feed, and then one person to help guide the piece of plywood out the back side. So a lot of home remodelers and general carpenters will set up this style, uh, which is commonly called a floor style cutting platform. Um, so again, the four inch provides a much better surface. As you can see here, I've got a piece of plywood sitting right here, and that gives me enough clearance for my clamp to then cut and clamp a uh, cutting guide. And so here's the cutting guide. You commonly would put the clamp on each end and secure it. into place uh, for running your plywood cut. I'll just do it a little quick example here. All right, there's one, and then here's two. So as you can see, here we go. This provides enough height uh, to get your clamps underneath the plywood. If, if it was only a two by four, uh, one two by four, the bottom of this would be rubbing the ground and you just wouldn't be happy with it. So two by fours, or excuse me, four by four post, best way to go. And again, what this provides is a, is a cutting edge for cutting your plywood in either direction. Um, all my builder manuals detail how to set this up and how to use this and how to set uh, your appropriate line to fence distance measurements or what I call it. Um, so basically that's it. Uh, this is how you cut large sheets of plywood you can get very accurate, very straight cuts using this method. Uh, you wouldn't think so, it kind of looks archaic, uh, but this is actually a long tested and proven method for cutting plywood. Um, and I guess that's it. Uh, it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward, and I definitely consult my builder manual for more details. Thanks for watching. This is Jeff of SimSamurai.net. Have a good day.